COVID-19 Update, Wednesday, April 8, 2020. There's a lot going on. Here are today's COVID-19 updates that you should know. Your daily dose of hope. Wuhan, the Chinese city at the epicenter of the global pandemic, emerged from lockdown after 76 days. Some restrictions still apply for the city of 11 million, where the coronavirus was first detected in December. New Zealand stands apart as the only country with more than 1,000 cases of COVID-19 and just one death. Kids in New Zealand will still get their Easter baskets, Prime Minister Jacinda Ardern added the Easter bunny to the list of essential workers, along with the tooth fairy. Meanwhile, New Zealand is being heralded as a leader for their efforts to contain the coronavirus, the efforts worked, resulting in only one death. Embedded content from Twitter.com News you need to know Detroit area officials have ordered portable refrigeration units to increase morgue capacity. Detroit has quickly become one of the hardest hit U.S. cities by the pandemic, with more than 400 deaths. Embedded content from Twitter.com American songwriter John Prine died Tuesday of complications related to COVID-19. Prine, 76, was known for folk country classics such as Hello in There and Sam Stone. Japan reported its biggest daily jump in COVID-19 infections Wednesday. Prime Minister Shinzo Abe this week declared a state of emergency in Tokyo, Osaka, and five other areas. Collateral damage, the pandemic is reversing environmental bans on plastic bags in many U.S. states, out of fear that shoppers' reusable bags could be contaminated with the coronavirus. Quote of the day, now something so sad has hold of us that the breath leaves and we can't even cry. Charles Bukowski Data of the day. An image with the description statistic, number of coronavirus, COVID-19, cases worldwide as of April 8, 2020, by country, Statista. Find more statistics at Statista. Are your employees okay? Chances are they're not. Free tools to check in on them can be found here.